Welcome to Scripps Health. The birth of a baby is one of life's most cherished moments, and we're excited that you've chosen Scripps Memorial Hospital La Jolla to have your baby. We're here to support you every step of the way to create your ideal pregnancy and delivery experience. On this virtual tour, you'll get to know our labor and delivery unit, where your baby will be born, and our mother-baby unit, where you will room in with your baby until you go home. In addition, we'll share valuable information about our breastfeeding support services to help get you and your baby off to the best possible start. One of the first things you'll want to do is pre-register for your hospital stay. It's easy to do this online using the form on our website. This will help speed things up when you check into the hospital during labor. It's best to pre-register between 20 to 24 weeks, but any time before you start labor is fine. If you don't already have a pediatrician, it's important to choose one before your baby is born. Just go to scripts.org, click on Find a Doctor, and type Pediatrics into the box. From there, you can get to know the pediatricians affiliated with Scripps Health and find the right match. Be sure to check with your insurance to see which doctors are in your network and which services are covered to avoid unexpected expenses. Pack your hospital bag before you go into labor so you're ready when the time comes. If you and your doctor have put together a birth plan, bring a copy of it, along with anything you need to help you relax and prepare for labor and delivery. Bring clothes to wear home for both you and the baby, shoes that are easy to slip in and out of, your phone charger, a change of clothes for your partner, and snacks. Don't overdo it, just bring what you need. When you go into labor, the first thing you'll want to do is call your doctor, who will let you know when to come to the hospital. If you arrive between 5 a.m. and 8 p.m., you'll enter through the Women's Center and check in. Then you'll take the elevator to the second floor, where you will find our labor and delivery unit. Should you arrive between 8 p.m. and 5 a.m., push the button on the keypad to the right of the Women's Center entrance, and one of our team members will let you in. For the safety of our mothers and babies, our entire birth center is a locked unit, and all staff members wear photo ID badges. We offer an infant banding security system to further ensure your baby's safety and your peace of mind. Our labor and delivery unit has 12 private birthing suites, each with a fold-out couch for your partner. We offer remote wireless monitoring so you can move comfortably around your room or in the hallways during labor. They are waterproof, so will work in the shower as well. We want you to be as comfortable as possible during labor, and we have many items that can help you, such as showers, birthing balls, peanut balls, aromatherapy, flameless candles, and more. When you and your baby are ready for delivery, we'll be ready too. We'll make every effort to honor your birth plan and provide the experience you desire. Your partner or primary support person is welcome in the room during delivery, along with your baby's siblings, but please keep in mind that space is limited. Depending on your obstetrician, a certified nurse midwife also may assist with the birth. Some women have only moderate discomfort during labor and delivery. For others, the pain may be more intense. If you would like medication for pain, we can offer an epidural or IV pain medication. If your baby is delivered by cesarean section, your support person may stay with you in the operating room. Your care team will include obstetricians, nurses, a neonatal intensive care team, and an anesthesiologist, along with any other specialists who may be needed. We wholly support family-centered care to promote early bonding and breastfeeding with your newborn. Immediately after delivery, we'll gently place your baby on your chest. This is the start of the golden hour when we encourage skin-to-skin -skin contact between you and your baby for their first hour of life. After you've had this time together, we'll weigh your newborn and give them their medications. Right after delivery, it is standard to delay cord clamping. We then offer your partner to cut the cord. Except in special circumstances, all newborns room in with mom. Shortly after delivery, you'll be transferred to our mom and baby unit for postpartum care until you are ready to go home. All postpartum rooms are private and include room service, a refrigerator, and a fold-out couch for your partner to spend the night. 
Visitors are welcome from 8.30 a.m. until 8 p.m. Your children may visit but cannot spend the night, so please plan accordingly. All other visitors must be at least 12 years of age. For the safety of the babies, we ask family members and friends to stay home if they are not feeling well. This includes anyone with colds, flu, fever, or a runny nose. Some babies require extra care following delivery. Scripps Health partners with specialists from Rady Children's Hospital and our Level 3 Neonatal Intensive Care Unit allows your baby to stay on site and close to you while receiving expert attention. An obstetrician and pediatrician will check in with you daily until you go home. Generally, we discharge moms who deliver vaginally one to two days after delivery. If you have a cesarean section, you can expect to go home two to four days after delivery. In most cases, you'll be discharged in the morning. Please plan ahead for your transportation home. Before you and your baby leave the hospital, you will need to have a car seat properly installed in your vehicle. Our staff cannot assist with the installation of your car seat, so please ensure that it is installed correctly before your ride arrives at the hospital. Finally, we support the 10 steps to successful breastfeeding as outlined by the World Health Organization. We're committed to helping you and your baby with breastfeeding before and after delivery, both in the hospital and once you're back home. Our prenatal breastfeeding classes help prepare you for a successful experience. After your baby is born, dedicated nurses who are specially trained in the latest breastfeeding techniques will help you get started with feeding during your hospital stay. We also offer private lactation appointments. Visit scripps.org forward slash obstetrics or call our lactation support line at 858-626-4538. For more information on lactation support, breast pump rentals, weekly breastfeeding support groups, and other resources. Thank you for taking the tour with us. We look forward to caring for you and your baby.